this morning just been working on all of the Instagram pages so if you aren't following any of my Instagram pages all the links are in the bio below so just been doing shout outs and social media marketing all this morning but that's why I haven't got much on camera at the moment but now I'm just having in my legend shake you can get this at legendsofmuscle.com some of the EHP Labs PSI pre-workout so this is the non-stim in Blue Raz so that's it there going to be having this and going to be training some arms and abs at the gym later today. So hopefully it'll be a really good workout and I'll show you the workout plan after it all. But having this, we'll see you inside the car. Let's go. Hello, Mr. B. Right, so what's good YouTube? In the car now, so just finished drinking my PSI pre-workout and I, like personally I've been loving it just knowing that like I say each time that it's non-stimulant. So today going to be smashing out some arms in the gym and like I want to try and work on the typewriter at the end of it so working on like I, it's like the pull-up exercise so hopefully get some of that on camera. That's my car dinging so I'll have to get fuel as well on the way home. But hopefully be an awesome workout. As always, I'll be showing you my workout routine at the end of the edit. So uh, you can get it earlier if you want on my Twitter, Jai underscore Cassidy. Or you can get it on my Instagram, which is Jai Cassidy Fitness. Now, all of my social media links are in the uh, comment section below or the bio caption below. I, never, I always forget what part that is. So that's my camera falling. I can't reset it as I'm driving, but... Hopefully we'll see you all inside the gym and you enjoy this edit. Let's go. So had a awesome workout today was an epic pump arm workout so it's quite a mouthful to sort of uh, say the workout uh, routine I'm going to show you now and it is live on my Twitter Jai underscore Cassidy and it normally goes up on my snapchat story and uh, Instagram story so let's uh, see the workout now let's go this is today's epic arm workout so eccentric movement for all of these 45 second rests in between sets it's a killer rest uh, for that short period. Starting off with some wide grip pull-ups, three sets by 10. Moving straight into it, rope tricep pushdowns, supersetted with an end bar, three by 15, 12, 10. So the end bar is like, it's a metal thing that looks like an end type of thing. I'm not too sure what it's called. Straight after that, moved into the barbell bicep curls, three sets, 15 for a warm up, then eight and six. So that was by 50 kilos, I think it was. After that, moved on to the single arm bicep curl that was on a cable. You can do it standing if you like. Three sets, 10, eight and six with one second pause at the top. After that, moved on to the seated behind the head tricep push. I don't know what the name of them are. 
three sets, 25, 15, 10. Moving right after that, tricep kick up, kickbacks, three sets, 15. Finishing off all the time, this gives you the best pump, I'll tell you what. Seated bicep curls, it's a drop set till failure. Now the seated bicep curls, I normally start off at 41 kilos, do about 15 reps or as many possible as I can without uh, bad form. Drop it about a pin or two, then keep going till failure, and then until I'm at five kilos and can't lift that weight anymore. Then at the end, what I also did, I never put it down on my workout routine, is this is a YouTube special, is I reverse grip the preacher curl. So doing uh, 25 until failure, basically. And that, I tell you what, finishes off with an epic pump and works on your forearms. So hopefully you enjoyed today's epic arm workout. So I'm I'm wrapped about it like it's a great workout. Definitely give it a go. And if you do give it a go, let me know in the comment section below. As always, hit that subscribe and like button because I am getting used to uh, these three vlogs a week. So Monday, Wednesday, Friday, this will probably be a really big one that I'll try and cram into one uh, big uh, video for Monday. So they are a little bit longer, but they've got a lot more like information and everything in them. So please share my videos around. Hit that subscribe and like button. That's all I ever ask from you guys and girls, and I will see you all in the next clip. Peace! Finally got some fuel in the car so it can stop dinging. I don't know if anyone else has that feeling when you get new like fuel in your car and it's like stopped dinging and it's a full tank. Best feeling. At least you know you've got fuel in your car. But now, going home along the water, going to enjoy this. See you all tomorrow. So what's good YouTube? Back again. It's the next day already. I've just got to ask a question. So this is a serious question. Uh, I'm not too sure how I certainly feel about the three day vlogs a week. Like I thought the interaction and views would have gone up just because I'm not producing as many videos, but they're actually stayed the same. So please let me know in the comment section below if you prefer the three day videos or the daily vlogging. Cause like the daily vlogging does get me out there a lot more. It is a little bit more effort on the daily uh, like computer and that, but in saying that I'm still editing at night, so it's maybe another hour or so. So please let me know what you think, uh, if you prefer the three day videos or if you prefer the daily videos and the daily upload of the workout routines and everything like that, because I really wanna know and like, try and help everyone what they want. So let me know in the comment section below. I'm just going to be sending some emails today and then going to be training chest later on. So hopefully you enjoyed this second half of the video. Let's go. So just looked out the back window and have a look at this little guy. He's now my new little friend. Look at him. This is Jai's nature channel now. So just thought it'd be something different to try and get in the vlog so gonna put him on the palm tree so he's all safe now and see you all in the next clip right so i'm ready for the gym now just had my psi pre-workout by ehp lab so this is it here again it's really nice and uh i like it like i say each time because of the non-stims so just had that today in my legend shaker which is this here you can get yours at legendsofmuscle.com and t today just wrapping uh, the Muscle Nation like t-shirt because it is a bit cold. So going to be training chest and maybe a little bit of abs. I'll see how I go. It depends how busy the gym is. But in 3, 2, 1, you'll see me in the gym. So what's going on YouTube? At the gym now. I just wanted to quickly uh, point out what I was saying by not doing the daily vlogging at the moment. So what I was saying in thinking the views would go up. So this is my most recent video. Normally on an average day, I get anywhere between 60 to 100 views. But at the moment, since I've cut back to three, I've just been getting the same amount. Whereas like the daily, I was getting about the same amount of views, which probably isn't much for the amount of subscribers I've got. So if you've got any tips on how I can get my views up, please let me know. But yeah, I'm just still trying to figure out whether I should go back to the daily vlogging or if I should stick to the three day vlog. So please let me know in the comment section below. Let's go smash this chest workout. See you inside the gym.
What's going on YouTube? Back in the car. So finished off a awesome chest workout today. So I've got it all here. Again, you can get this earlier on my, uh, what is it? Twitter. Sorry, had memory blank for a minute there. So Twitter, Jai underscore Cassidy, all the social media links I'll show you right now. Let's get into it. So first off, always go follow, him, follow me on all my social media links. Today's chest workout started off with wide grip pull-ups, three sets by 10. All of these are eccentric movement. Getting straight into the chest workout, it was incline dumbbell press, three sets, 10, eight, but, and then six. Decline barbell press, haven't done for a long time, three sets, 15, 10, and six. They were really good. Uh, I haven't done dumbbell press for such a long time, so it was really good to really uh, start doing again and trying to like, work out how like my shoulder used to pinch when doing it so it was good to get back into that and i'll show you the next exercise straight after the decline moved on to seated pec fly three sets 25 15 12. then moved on to the what bow bow bench press wide neutral close grip these are super sets so if you can start off light 25 25 reps each one, so 25 wide, 25 neutral, 25 close, then 15 wide, neutral, close, so on, so forth. Finishing off with cable flies, three sets by 25, super setted with uh, windshield wipers for abs. So I love doing those windshield wipers at the end of a workout for abs, just going side to side, I don't know, I've just always been able to do them and my core loves it, so uh, definitely if you can give it a go, definitely give it a go, if not, do Russian twists or even uh, laying leg wipers on the ground is also a good way to work up to it. So hopefully you enjoyed today's chest workout. I've got to go home, clean my car as there's crap all on it. I don't know, something happened when with the rain, there's all dirt and everything. So going home to clean my car, then relax for a Saturday night. I'm not too sure if I'm going out yet, but if I do, I will see you all tomorrow. I'm going home now to clean the car. See you in the next clip. So what's good YouTube? It's the next day. So today I'm going to be training with a friend at Derham Gym, so which is around the corner from uh, my gym, but unfortunately I can't record in there because it is a big commercial gym and some of the guys in there really don't like a camera. So unfortunately I won't be getting any footage of that, but when I'm home, I'm just going to be going a little in depth about the EHP Labs PSI pre-workout and a few of the other like supplements and that. So hopefully you stick around for that and enjoy this third half of today's vlog let's go right so i just thought i'd do a quick little review on the ehp labs psi pre-workout so some of the uh, things or the key benefits of it it actually gives you uh, some mental focus that some of the ingredients in it really help so the main one that they advertise it for is the muscle pumps and the nitric oxide so that really helps uh, fire up your atp system in your muscles and really get that pump when in the gym and the vascularity really starts coming out so you notice in a lot of my videos that my veins come out a lot it's because the ingredients in this you'll notice emphasize the blood flow through your muscles and that causes your veins and that to really get like enhanced and full so that really shows it a lot more so like i said the two ingredients are the nitric oxide i'm just reading it so i get it correct the nitric oxide and the muscle cell plasma so they're the two main ingredients that help with that pump and the vascularization or vascularity uh, when training so it's a really good pre-workout uh, pre like i said it's got no caffeine or any stimulants in it to elevate your heart rate or anything like that so you can have it late at night if you're a nighttime trainer say after like eight o'clock or something like that and go to bed after it so it's a really good pre-workout for if you're going to have it at night or you're just not used to the stimulants or beta alanine you can also add the beta alanine or something like creatine in it as well. So personally, I normally have this and about five grams of creatine before gym and that really helps for the pump and really boosting uh, your ATP system to push that extra bit of weight. Then after the gym, I usually have my post-workout shake which is two scoops whey protein, uh, BCAA, glutamine and a little bit more creatine. So that's normally that's all the supplements i take so i used to take a high stim pre-workout which was like the so you call c4 but now i'm using this on a daily basis just because 
I'd rather look after my heart and stuff like that. And if you are having like a really exhausting day or you want that extra kick like on a leg day is you can uh, have, I think it's called their RPM, which has got the booster in it for the stimulants. So they're two really good pre-workouts if you want to get to add to your pre-workout stack. But today just ended up training with a friend. I never got uh, wrote down the workout program that I did today. So unfortunately I didn't get that. But now going to go on the computer for the rest of today, edit all of this footage up and hopefully put it out for Monday, the normal time that I'm doing the new vlogs. As always, comment below if you do like the new three vlogs a week or if you prefer it the daily vlogging. As always, hit that subscribe and like button and I'll see you all Wednesday.